Good afternoon. How y'all doing? It's your boy Devon Messenger. And before you answer that question, I know you're doing good. I just like asking you that because it's really good to know that somebody out there is doing great and you're staying staying motivated. I actually know you're staying motivated and you better be staying motivated or we're going to have a problem. Before we get into this, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, man, because I ain't going to make this video too long. I just want to get somebody, I want to help somebody enlighten themselves when it comes to their niche or how you can be a better social media influencer or content creator. Understand. Post a goddamn video, gang. What are you sitting here procrastinating for? What are you comfortable? Why are you chilling? Why are you sitting there chilling when you know you got shit to accomplish? You know you want to be somewhere in life. You know you want to get somewhere in life. But yet you're sitting here doing nothing but watching this video. And you still ain't even subscribed to the channel. You get what I'm saying? You see how lazy you are? But let's break this down. A lot of you have so many ideas. A lot of you have over a thousand ideas. You take these ideas in your notes all day, but you don't act on them. Faith without works is dead. How do you want to get somewhere in life and you don't want to put in the work? You don't want to post these videos. A lot of you care about the views and the likes. Understand, are you doing this for views and likes or are you doing this for yourself? Are you pleasing yourself or are you trying to please other people? Because if you're doing this just for the benefit of clout or the benefit of likes and views, you're going to fall off very fast because we don't get everything that we deserve. And do we really deserve it? Probably not because you haven't worked for it. You're not disciplined every single day to keep on posting when them views is low. Because given them, there's a there's somebody out there right now who's been posting for years and they're still getting like one or two views. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of you will get these amount of views or likes and you'll take it for granted and you'll be like, man, my shit is trash. No, it's not. And I understand these gatekeepers run these algorithms. They run these algorithms. So by them doing this, what's destined in the universe is going to happen good or bad, whether you realize it or not. You feel what I'm saying? Doesn't mean your videos are trash. But what can you do to improve your quality? What can you do to gain people's attraction? What can you do to elevate somebody, including yourself? Because who are you doing this for once again? If you're doing this just for revenue, if you're doing this just for the views and the clout and the attention, you're gonna you're gonna fall off. And I'm not I'm dead ass serious. You're gonna fall off because people will see that you're not true to yourself. All you're doing this for is just to please somebody else. And people don't like that type of shit. You have to be honest with yourself. Are, are your videos really that nice? Are you really doing your job? Do you get up every single day when shit is hard and do you keep on pushing? Or do you just give up? Because the moment you give up is the moment you don't even know what could have happened because you gave up. Your breakthrough could have happened the next day, but you wouldn't know because you quit on this day. You feel me? There's nothing wrong with quitting because a lot of people are quitters, but in order for you to quit, you have to know what it feels like to be losing a lot. The thing is, nobody loses. We just take lessons. So take this lesson and bring these ideas and put them into your ideas. Put them into your video ideas. Put them into your ideas with your journal, within your life, within your coworkers, your family. Start doing things that are going to better yourself in your life. You feel what I'm saying? A lot of you want... You want a certain standard to live at. You want this high status. You want to have so much revenue coming in. You want to take care of your family. You want to get about the hood, out the suburbs. You want to live on your own. You want to start taking trips out the country. Understand, you already did this. But in order for you to reach that scenario in a different earth reality or whatever you want to call it or your future, you have to start doing things now to build towards your future. You get what I'm saying? You will want Your future self will want you to do what it takes to get to that high status right now your future self will thank you for what you're doing right now but the thing is though many of you are lazy as hell so you're not doing shit with your life because you are sitting there doing nothing you are sitting there trying to get tutorials from other people who don't know what they're doing as well so you have a bunch of blind leaders leading you towards a blind path and you don't know where you're going and now you're stuck you're trying to figure out what can you do to improve your quality of videos how can you do this how can you do that nigga just do it you're going to mess up you're going to fall down you're going to you just have to get back up you got to get back up stop complaining when things get hard stop complaining when things get difficult you have to stop crying all the time stop getting in your feelings because the world will keep spinning or keep moving with or without your feelings nobody gives a fuck just keep going you have to keep going because there will come a time to where social media will be your full-time job but here's the thing about that as well whenever you start posting your goddamn content and whenever you start making that breakthrough when the people start realizing who you are and what you've been doing for so many years understand the job you used to have will not be that job that you used to have anymore you will be a full-time social media influencer so when things get hard as a social media influencer who are you how will you act? How will you react to when things are hitting the fan? To when things aren't all copacetic? Because understand, when you are at the top, there are a lot of things that will try to bring you down from the top. And how will you react to these type of things? Will you start crying about it? Will you want to kill yourself? Will you start looking for 
people to come help you who really don't want to help you. How will you go about these things? You have to start taking yourself seriously and isolate yourself from distractions. You have to stop distracting yourself from being comfortable and learn to be uncomfortable with changing yourself and who you are and your mindset. It's all a mind thing, mind over matter. You get what I'm saying? You are not tired because being tired does not exist. Your physical body is tired, yes, but spiritually, you are not tired. You are never tired. You literally do not get tired. You get what I'm saying? So keep going because tomorrow is not promised. You have to promise yourself today that you will be better than who you were yesterday. So if you posted one video today, that's a great job. But tomorrow, why can't you post like six videos? What's stopping you from posting six videos? Oh, you don't have enough ideas. Yes, you do. You just don't want to think hard enough because you're too distracted. A lot of you want to go out and party, smoke some weed, drink. You want to go play the game. You want to go kick. You want to take a nap. While you are doing all these things, you could be putting these ideas towards your goals. Simple as that. But I don't want to make this video too long. I really appreciate you for watching. And thank you for understanding this message that came from Elohim. I love you. Have a great day.